it's Sejal and you're watching me on Nika TV. So a lot of you sent me request to do a back to college beauty and skin care guide. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm really excited about this. So I'm going to talk you through everything from skin care to makeup, everything you need to take during the back to college season. So let's get started. First thing is skin care. Good skin is very very important. No amount of makeup can fix it. So first thing that you need is a good moisturizer. Now this one is the Neutrogena Oil-Free Moisturizer. This one also has SPF 15, which is good. I have been using this one for over a year now, and because I have oily skin, it works really well for me. It's not heavy or doesn't leave your skin sticky, so I would definitely recommend this. The next thing you need is sunscreen. I cannot stress this enough. Everyone will tell you to use sunscreen, but I know everyone is so lazy you will never use it. Just please use it every day. Your skin will say thank you to you later on. So the one that I have is the La Roche Posay. This one is SPF 50, which is very great if you're into sports and generally it's very sunny outside anyway and all college kids are outside all day. So this is an essential. Next up is makeup. For college, I generally like to keep it very light um, and I think that's how it should be. You shouldn't pack your face with a lot of makeup because you're going to be out all day. It'll melt off anyway. So a little bit goes a long way. So BB cream in that case is very good. Foundation will just make you feel really heavy. So this one is pretty good. Uh, this is the L'Oreal True Match BB cream. It gives you light coverage and makes your skin sort of, it gives that a little bit of an airbrushed effect, which is perfect. The next thing you need is a pressed powder. Now, Everyone's out all day and your face tends to get oily, so something like this is perfect. Carry it in your bag and just touch up whenever you need to. My face has a problem, I get oiled up every time I put makeup, so I carry this around with me all the time. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte. It's really cheap as well, so it's perfect for college people. Okay, moving on to the eyes. This one is the L'Oreal Gel Liner in Chic Brown. It looks really natural and I think natural is way better than over the top. So you can just put a little bit of this on the top of your eyes next to your lash line and you should be good to go. The next thing for the eyes is mascara. Like I said, I'm over the whole wing liner look. So mascara is my new discovery and obsession. This one is Maybelline Lash Sensational Very Black. So even on days you don't feel like wearing makeup, you can just put on a little bit of mascara and you'll be good to go. Moving on, I think every college girl should have blush. It gives you a very nice, youthful kind of look. So I have this Lacme 9 to 5 Matte Mousse Lip and Cheek Color. This is perfect. You can just throw this in your bag. You can use it as a lip color, as a blush, both. No one has time to carry all kinds of different makeup products. This thing is perfect. It's in the shade Tangerine Fluff, which is a really nice bright orange, which is perfect for college going girls. Another thing you can carry for your lips is this matte lip crayon. It's by Sugar and it's in the shade Holy Go Lightly. Now this one is my favorite. I've used this up a lot and it's like your natural lip color but it looks better. And uh, another thing you can do with something like this is mix it with a little bit of lip balm and it gives you a slightly glossier look which looks really pretty. Now before all of that, you need a good lip balm. Something with SPF would be even better, like this one by Neutrogena. Uh, this is long lasting, it keeps your lips moisturized all day long. And um, this one I carry around with me every day. And I'm sure all of you feel like you have chapped lips all the time. This will solve your problem. And throw this in your bag and everything will be fine. Another thing you should have are good nail polishes. Now Nykaa has very pretty colors and they have so many of them. So you can go with your usual, the glossy kind. And my favorite is this pink one and the shade is called Bubble Yum. It's very cute and definitely give the matte ones a try. They look really nice and they have a very different effect to them so you can try those out as well. My favorite is this uh, Periwinkle Blue kind and the shade is called uh, Blueberry Macaron and I would definitely recommend these two. Next is hair. Now this is something I use every time I wash my hair. It's the Be Blunt Volumizing Spray. Now what you have to do is when you wash your hair, flip it upside down. Spray this in your roots and blow dry it from the top and your hair will get a lot of volume and this just changes the look in 5 minutes. Should definitely try this one out. You should also have dry shampoo with you. Now there's so many days when you just wake up late, you're so lazy, you don't want to wash your hair. This thing will help you. So what you have to do is just take this, spray it in your roots and just shake it up and it'll instantly refresh your hair. It'll take all the grease away. It'll add volume and make you look like you washed your hair, which is very convenient. My favorite is this one by Batiste. I use this very, very often and it works wonders. 
Now that we've talked about so much makeup, you need a good makeup remover. Do not sleep with your makeup on at night. You will get pimples and you will have horrible skin. Please don't do that. I know I do that all the time. But just try. So this is by Bioderma. It's a very very good makeup remover. I use this a lot and it's not like oily. It won't make your skin feel very greasy. It's just like water and it works really really well. Definitely try this out. Okay now this is an essential. Those days when you don't want to go get waxed and you know you just feel a little hairy. I know that's a lot of information, but a razor is always handy and the best one in the market is this one by Gillette Venus. I have this and I carry this around almost everywhere I go for those days when you have to wear a sleeveless top and you don't have the time to go to the parlor. So not much to say. This is an essential. You need it. So that is it for today's video and those were all my essentials for back to college. I hope you enjoyed and I hope it helped you out. Do comment below your favorites and if you want to add anything to the list and do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Do not forget to subscribe to Nike TV and my channel as well and I'll see you next time. Bye.